classify materials based on the ability to absorb water, float, sink, and undergo decay. Materials that absorb water Absorb Absorb means to take in something such as liquid in a natural or gradual way. Porous materials Porous materials are materials that absorb water, have small holes that allow air or liquid to pass through. Examples of porous materials that are made of cotton are cotton buds, coffee filter, floor mop, cotton wool, and thread. Examples of porous materials that are made of wood are envelope, tissue paper, notebook, and newspaper. Examples of porous materials that are made of cloth are shirt, jeans, socks, skirt, and carpet. Other examples of porous materials are sponge and coconut husk. Non-porous materials Non-porous materials are materials that do not absorb water. They do not allow air or water to pass through. Examples of non-porous materials that are made of plastic are plastic bag, raincoat, and umbrella. Examples of non-porous materials that are made of rubber are tire, rubber band, and sleeper. Other examples of non-porous materials are glass, metal, marbles, and stone. Materials that float and sink Density is a measure of how heavy something is compared to its size. It determines whether an object will float or sink. Float means to stay on top of the water. Examples of objects that float, styrofoam, and wood. Many hollow things like walls, balloons, empty bottles will also float. That is because the air is less dense than water. This is also the reason why a big ship can float though it is very heavy. There are lots of hollow space filled only with air inside of a ship. Remember, if an object is less dense than the water it is placed in, it will float. Sink means to go at the bottom of the water. Examples of objects that sink are coin and metal. If an object is denser than the water it is placed in, it will sink. In case of sponge, we can notice that it floats at first on the water. However, as it begins to absorb water, it gets too heavy and sinks. Materials that undergo decay Biodegradable or bio-waste these are materials that undergo decaying. They are decomposed by microorganisms into environment-friendly waste products. They cannot be recycled. 
factors that contribute to the decaying process of the materials. Water, sunlight, soil, and action of microorganisms.